Hey everyone, so I'm back with a much requested video on how I make my burlap roses, so stay tuned. Why spend too much time just getting ready? All right, so first thing we're gonna do here is we're going to take one of our corners and we're gonna fold it over to meet the edge, like I'm showing you here. So we're gonna take a little bit of glue and we're gonna place it in there and then we're going to press firmly down, let the glue cool. And then we're going to take that corner, that triangle edge, and we're gonna roll it and make our bud. Once we get our bud rolled up, we're gonna put a little glue there and we're gonna just roll it on to the end there. And then we're gonna press on it, make sure the glue's sticking really good and then we're going to let it cool again. Okay, so once we get our bud made and everything, we're gonna take that corner right there that I'm messing with right now and we're gonna fold it backwards and we're just gonna adjust it until we get it to the shape we want. And then we're gonna add a little hot glue there to hold it in place. So basically all we're going to do is we're going to keep folding it backwards towards the back and we're going to glue it in place after we get the shape that we are happy with. And we're just going to keep repeating this process over and over, adding glue as we twist backwards and fold backwards and just go around the rows. Diving in the deep blue Are you looking for you tonight? I'm diving in the deep blue Are you looking for you, my love? I don't like it when we're fighting Cause you always make me cry, yeah I'm diving in the deep blue Are you looking for you? Cause you're the one, the one no. Crazy, but you know I'll do anything for you, baby. Cause you're the one, the one I want. I'm driving in the moonlight. I am looking for signs tonight. I'm driving. So once you get all your petals done, um, you want to make sure you glue down the back and make sure it's flat and everything. Um, if there happens to be a little bit of the bud poking out the back after you get everything glued, you can just trim that off. It's not gonna go anywhere. Um, so, right here, I am just taking my scissors and cutting off the frayed edges of that one. I was using a piece of burlap that I used on my Christmas tree because I was all out of my roll and I really needed to get this video up for y'all. I had actually filmed this video twice before but I just couldn't get my angle right and it's still not perfect but uh, it's better than the other two I promise. Mm -hmm. 
So here I'm just showing you um, two of them that I made. Um, one was in this video and um, it turned out a little more square than I would have liked. Um, but you just kind of kind of work with it and just um, it's just all trial and error. So I hope that um, this video helped and um, just let me know in the comments if this really helped you. Um, I want to thank you for watching and please hit the subscribe button if you haven't already subscribed. Y'all have a great night. Bye.